hello viewers welcome to my channel in today's class we shall be looking at expansion of algebraic terms what do we mean by this this simply means opening up of barriers this simply means opening up of barriers that is to delete barriers to open the brackets the brackets here are the barriers you can see the brackets in these questions are our barriers so they are what is disturbing us. so expansion of algebraic terms simply means opening up of barriers disturbing us. and what are the barriers the brackets now let's take a look at these questions the first one is 2x open bracket x minus y close bracket minus 3y open bracket 4x plus 3y this is very simple so we will just want to expand just want to expand in order to do this we use this to multiply this first then again this we multiply this 2x multiplied by x so we have 2 the coefficient of s here is 1 so 2 multiplied by 1 that is 2 then x multiplied by x that is s squared that's the first one the second step then we say 2x multiplied by minus y the sign here is plus positive sign plus times minus we have minus then 2x multiplied by y we have 2x y so then we move on we have successfully opened the, the barriers here we have successfully opened up the barriers here so we have deleted the brackets we move on so here we also use this to multiply this then after that we use this again to multiply this so let's take a look at the sign here the sign here is negative sign and the sign here is positive sign minus times plus we have minus then 3 multiplied by 4 we have 12 then y multiplied by x we have xy then let's take a look at the second one minus times plus we have minus 3 multiplied by 3 we have 9 then y multiplied by y we have y squared then let's look at this if we have something in common okay minus 2xy we also have a minus 2xy minus 2xy and minus 12xy you can see that they are they have something in common so we can add them or subtract them from each other so let's take a look at what is going to happen here minus 2xy minus 12xy so we are going to have minus 14 x y then minus 9 y squared so we have successfully expand these algebraic terms so you can see it's very simple let's take a look at the second one so the second question says 3a minus x y open bracket 3a minus x y then we have another one open bracket 3a plus x y so we want to expand this also so the first thing we pick this we use it to multiply everything here everything in this bracket that is 3a multiplied by this then again 3a multiplied by this so let's take a look at that 3 multiplied by 3 we have 9 a multiplied by a we have a squared then the next one 3a multiplied by then we are going to have so the sign here they are both positive signs so we have our positive sign here plus times plus we have plus 3a multiplied by xy we have 3a xy then we are done with the first one we do the same thing by picking the second one here which is minus xy we are going to use minus xy to multiply everything in this bracket so we do that minus times plus we have minus xy multiplied by 3a we have 3 e x y then minus times plus we have minus x multiplied by x we have x squared y multiplied by y we have y squared so let's take a look at this do we have anything in common here yes 
3 a x y 3 a x y but their sign are different we have plus here we have minus here so they will cancel each other then our final answer is going to be 9 a square minus a square y square so we have successfully expand these algebraic terms also by opening up the barriers so we don't have any barrier in this question again so let's take a look at the third one the third says if a square f minus 5x plus c equals to open brackets x minus 8 close brackets open bracket x plus 3 close brackets then we are asked to find the value of c when you look at this a square minus 5x plus c the c here is the unknown value so that is what we are asked to find but we are going to focus on this after solving this then we are going to have the value for our unknown value which is represented with c so let's go ahead by expanding this algebraic terms and the algebraic terms here is s minus 8 open bracket s plus 3 so x multiplied by x don't forget we use this s to multiply everything in this bracket so let's do that first x multiplied by x we have x squared x multiplied by 3 we have plus 3x then we are done with the first one the second one we move on to minus 8 minus times plus there is a positive sign here we have minus 8 multiplied by x we have 8x then we have minus multiplied by plus again we have minus then 8 multiplied by 3, we have 24. Alright, we have a square, then plus 3x minus 8x, so that is what? Minus 5x minus 24. So when you look at this final answer here, you notice that it is very similar to this. So we have x square here, x square here, minus 5 s here, minus 5 s here. So here we have plus c. Here we have minus 24. So the value of c here is now what is minus 24 here. So our final answer is c equals to minus 24. Thanks for watching guys. Kindly subscribe to my YouTube channel. Mass made easy with Unifadi and also like my Facebook page. Thanks for watching.